Tonzi ya gama titu wa gala nei Ngana nge mwen kwa gala Welcome to Loudoun City where we bring you up close with celebrities giving insight into what they do, how they do it and why they do what they do. Loudoun City brings to you all the entertainment. We've had the times to beef but I think it's time now we, we should agree. I like Taekwondo because I'm black belt. That's where my strength is. Yo what's up this is Pia Bekun member Uganda's number one versatile member. Be there Gagamel Semi said stay right here, right here. Loudoun City. Music and fashion have always moved hand in hand. The ever trendy music following always loves to see their superstars look good and move along so well in the fashion world. I, I had fans that looked up to me, like really went and bought the clothes I had in my music videos. You have a fashion statement that we, we have never seen you without that cap on your head. But Chicho, any more dogorio? Domanya. Probably by one day you will. No, For like, now it's a branding thing. As a result, artists have made an effort to always keep their closets up to date, with some even venturing into the fashion and design business. In Uganda, most artists have either hired designers or opened up their own design shops. Singer Layla, who has embraced fashion at all times, had admitted that looking good has sold her music to a large extent. If my fans that love the way I, I put up my, I mean, they love my fashion sense, why don't I bring the things to them? How? Let me open up a fashion store and make sure everything that they see that is good on me, they know where to buy it. Kampala's nightlife has always been a cocktail of the Proudy and Zap Rivieras. You just look at your crowd and know what you want. Give them the parties they will not find even in town. What do people want? They want a night called Dr. Than Nancy, so we can do that. While some people opt to flop dance clubs, another population prefers the soft, soothing side to spend their nightlife. Party rockers have slowly triggered to attending band sessions. Theme night bars are slowly penetrating to Kampala's nightlife. Bands like Jamzy Band, which plays at Big Mike's Bar, Steve Keys at Gatomato, plus several others taking up night spots, bands are surely taking over as prominent night plot in most hangouts. Because we've, we've managed to understand what our clients want. Start with having good sound. And then, secondly, you need you need to rehearse. Now, with several theme nights in most Kampala hangouts, popular Ugandan artists are also slowly evading the tread. Keeping your fans on the road every single day is important, and achieving every single day is important. Angela Kale is an established artist on her own, but then with the whole band, I have quite a number of vocalists, instrumentalists who need to be seen, who need to, to you know, to showcase what talent they have to the whole world, and I felt. This was a great opportunity for them to showcase what they have. Hi, this is your gallery in Tale and you're watching Loud and City. Ready and Wizzo. Mambi Mujok Swangs to Kolaka Yimba Rema. I love to do dinner with my friends and, you know. Have you imagined just celebrity divas in the kitchen? Have you imagined what kind of meals they would prepare? Hmm. They too have a life off the screen. At home, dinner is local. I'll do for you that matoke, beautiful one, and then I'll do for you uh, smoked fish with guinea. So local food is my thing. I'm very good at cooking. And what do you love to eat? I love eating matoke, steamed matoke. I love that. eating chicken. I think I eat chicken every day. Every day. <laughs> yeah, I love chicken. I love avocado. I love greens. Why would you imagine Zuena's love for Pilawa would hold her from preparing her family's favorite meal? She often finds time off to prepare meals for her family. Zuena loves to cook. I'm not the kind who loves partying and what. Of course, once in a while I do go out with my husband or a few friends, but I'm more of a, a mother at home, more of cooking, more of taking care of the home. 